Hi, kids. I'm Bob the Tomato. And I'm Larry. The guy who ate my pie. No, it's just the cucumber. What's wrong, Jimmy? What's wrong? What's wrong? I'll tell you what's wrong. Jerry, bring in Exhibit A. That's what's wrong. Oops. The three of us made this together. Yeah, together. I was super hungry. We were supposed to split it three ways. You ate all the pie and didn't include us. Did you ever stop to think that Jerry and I might be super hungry too? Yeah, super. And that we might be looking forward to enjoying our pie? Yeah, our pie. I'm sorry, guys. You can't put whipped cream on sorry, Buster. Was there an exhibit B? Uh, usually when there's an Exhibit A, there's an Exhibit B. I was thinking the pie was Exhibit B. Wasn't that Exhibit A? No, the pie tin's Exhibit A. The pie itself is Exhibit B. Which we can't really get to right now because it's in my stomach. Oh, that hurts! Like a pie in the face! Ouch! No, wait, I wasn't... Guys, I'm super sorry. Uh, pretty sure pies to the face don't hurt. This reminds me of a message we got from Jason, way up in Bangor, Maine. Dear Bob and Larry, my little brother is super annoying. He rode my bike without asking, and it got a flat tire. Now I can't ride it. I'm really mad at him. What should I do? Your friend, Jason. Hey, Jimmy. Well, Jason and Jimmy and Jerry and Larry, I think I've got a story that can help. Really? What's it about? It's about friendship and forgiveness. I was hoping it would be about pie. Roll film! That was a super groovy story, Bob. Out of sight! I know, mate. Looks like you guys enjoyed the show. Copy that, Papa Bear! Slap me some skin! Does that mean you like the story? And we learned an important lesson. Oh, yeah? What's that? The 70s were far out, man! Oh, show. That's not really the lesson I had in mind. And Larry, my brother, I know you didn't mean to lay a bummer on our summer. I forgive you for eating our pie. Yeah, me too. Dig it? Yeah, I dig it. Thanks, guys. I'm really sorry for eating the pie. By the way, I got you guys another pie. It's back in the green room. What do you say we go veg out in the green room, bro? Later. Sounds like QWERTY's got a verse for us. Be kind to one another, tender-hearted, forgiving one another, as God in Christ forgave you. Ephesians 4.32 Because God has forgiven us for the wrong things we have done, we can forgive others. In our story, both Junior and Lanny messed up, but their friends Laura and Dennis learned that rather than not forgiving and not having a friend, that they could forgive and be friends again. So Jason, your little brother might mess up and get on your nerves sometimes, but the best thing you can do is to forgive him. That's right. What are you doing? Being forgiven makes me want to dance. Well, that's all the time we have for today. Always remember, God made you special. And Groovy. And he loves you very much. Bye!